Well, hello, welcome back to my study. I want to take us to Isaiah chapter 31 and verse 6 today. Verse 6, uh, where Isaiah uh, writes this. He writes, Return, ye Israelites, to the one you have so greatly revolted against. Return. What does it mean to return to God? Well, the idea of returning is, is uh, the idea of repenting, to come back. So uh, uh, those who, who don't trust in God or uh, when we forget to trust in God, it's like we're walking away from him like this. And then we're called to repent or turn around and come back to him again, to return to God. So it's a, it's a, a change of heart to return to God and also a change of actions. How a change of actions? Well, in Isaiah, in Isaiah 31, it's who we trust in that's in view, isn't it? As we've seen over the last few days, uh, Judah trusted in Egypt to rescue her. We can trust in all sorts of things to rescue us, can't we? We might be sorted pretty much on uh, trusting only in Jesus for our eternal life. Although, do we sometimes wonder whether we need to do other things as well? Like be a good Christian to get to heaven? Well, there's no such thing as a good Christian. There's a good Christ and there's lots of forgiven sinners. So we just need to trust in him because he's given us the spiritual credit to be recognised as one of his when we meet when we meet God on the final day. But we might also trust in other things in, in our daily lives, mightn't we? Now, we'll, we'll touch on this on Sunday quite a lot, actually. So why not between now and Sunday? Just have a think through of what sorts of things do you trust a little bit much in the day to day? Uh, by trusting a bit much in them, you might be thinking about them too much. You, you might be... Uh, worried about losing these things a little bit too much. You, you might be uh, concerned that you don't have enough of something or enough time to do something that you think is going to make a material difference to your life. Or, or, or you might, it might be something spiritual. Uh, do you pray enough about things? That's worth thinking about between now and Sunday. I know I need to think about that. We all do. So returning to God means giving up some of those things, not necessarily completely. But it means giving up our allegiance to them, giving up trusting in them, putting weight onto them to either uh, get us to heaven or to make our lives good in this world. If we put our trust in things like that, in that way, then God calls us today to return to him. And we return with that change of heart and a, an active coming back to him. That would look like praying. It would look like saying sorry to God for going the wrong way. And it would look like asking him to help us to trust in him more and more every day. Let me pray now. Our Father, we're sorry when we have wandered away from you, when we've put too much weight on other things that aren't going to carry our, that aren't going to carry our worries or certainly aren't going to carry us into eternal life. So please would you uh, cause us to return to you. Grant us a spirit of repentance that we would be those who return to you quickly, day by day. And we pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. See you Sunday.